Hey guys, Andy Tran here with the Inner Bark Outdoors channel. If it's the first time on my channel, welcome. I do two videos in a week on the outdoor survival do-it-yourself and reviews. This is going to be a review on the VanQuest IBEX 35. As the name suggests, it's a 35 liter capacity backpack and it's made for sort of like the one to two day trip. And I'm gonna go right into the features and let you know how I like it. The Ibex 35 has a 35 liter capacity or in cubic inches, that's 2,135. It weighs in at 2.2 kilograms or 4.95 pounds. On the exterior, you have a bungee for rain gear or extra layers. And this includes a hypalon lip to keep items from falling out. This pack has two gear loops for ice axes, trekking poles, or tools. And it pairs well with the optional elasto gear locks which secures the handles. This pack is an internal frame pack and uses a semi-rigid polycarbonate frame. The frame itself is curved to the contours of your back and adds just the right amount of stiffness to it. The hip belt is adjustable with 2x2 two two attachments for pouches. One of my favorite features for this pack is that the Cordura goes up the air mesh so it helps keep a lot of that mud and dust and all that from getting packed into the air mesh. This pack has top and bottom compression straps and the top can be stowed away for a cleaner look when you're not using it. The side pockets have Hypalon Air Molly panels so you can attach any number of accessories. The inside of the side pockets have loop attachments as well as two smaller organizational pockets. You can also run a hydration pouch inside of the side pockets. And this is my preference when the weather is starting to get a little bit warmer so that you're not heating up all your water with body heat. There's a loop tucked away at the top of the side pocket so you can hook in your hydration pack. The hydration tube can be routed to the left side or the right side or center if you wanted to. But since we're going into summer, I'm gonna mount it to the side. This pack has a two-part brain compartment. The top part, which is smaller, has just enough room for my eyewear and also my headlamp. The bottom part is probably about two times bigger than the top one, and it can hold a drone and remote or a whole bunch of snacks. The bottom compartment can also be accessed from the inside of the main compartment. The main compartment itself opens up wide. They also included a bunch of loop panels on the sides, center, and on the flap. The center Velcro has air molly, so you can also attach any number of accessories that you want there as well. And on the flap, you have an internal mesh pocket that's zippered. I really like the lower profile of this bag. It's perfect for one to two days, and the low profile makes it less likely to snag on branches and other obstacles. So that is my review of the VanQuest IBEX 35. This thing is by far one of the best packs I've had. Will it replace, say, my Everly Stock? Probably not for every single occasion, because the Everly Stock backpack is made for carrying uh, like hunting rifles, sniper rifles, things like that. Um, and that's kind of their forte. And so uh, for everything else, this is gonna be pretty much my go-to. And in fact, I have a video that I put out just uh, not too long ago, actually, of my bug out bag where I use this pack as sort of the foundation of it. And so if you go ahead and take a look at that, it has uh, a pretty good idea. It gives you a pretty good idea of what you can carry in this thing. But uh, if you have any comments or questions, you can go ahead and either message me direct through Instagram or Facebook or comment down below. If you guys enjoyed the video, please like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to uh, check out that other social media. But as always, take care out there. Bye.